Season 20 of Apex Legends is currently under fire when it comes to an infestation of cheaters and hackers. Whether it be on PC where there's legitimately hacking going on to the point of the ALGS regional finals in North America being postponed and ultimately hacked during the initial attempts. Two people teaming like crazy on console. There's a lot of issues that need to be taken seriously by the team at Respawn. But before we get too far into today's topic, how about taking the time right now to like this video? If you're new, smash down the subscribe button with the notification bell so that you can get alerted anytime that I drop a new video. Do it! Now, oddly enough, it wasn't that long ago that the name Toofy would strike terror into the majority of content creators on Twitch as he was on a tear, not only session joining, but also cheating in every match of ranked that he possibly could. And a new warrior of the darkness, you could say, has popped up by the name of Destroyer 2009. And this time around, some of the hacks that are being employed are a little bit wild. Take a look at this, for instance. There are 47 people in dropship. Oh, okay. Never mind. We have a few people coming, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> nice nade, King. Dude, what am I watching? So how did how do you even do this? I don't know how's that even possible? Dying. Oh, they're in mid-air? I'm dead. I'm dead. Please help me. Please, please, please. Now, as you can see, there really isn't too much out of the ordinary there, except an entire army of people in the dropship following down and destroying Mandy. Now, the thing that needs to be taken note is those were all AI, which isn't the most impossible thing to think of happening in a Battle Royale game. But for Apex Legends, it definitely brings up a lot of concerns. And the more recent hack with the ALGS Regional Finals, it actually, at least from the standpoint of what is being the current narrative, is that two pro players were infected with cheats by compromised systems in Apex Legends. And we actually have an interesting discourse between Mandy and the hacker known as Destroyer 2009 that happened more recently in which he confronted and actually had a conversation with this person who explained a bit of what they're doing and why, albeit a little bit cryptically. Revenant. Are you a real person? Rev, hello? Oh wait, you're a destroyer 2009. Uh, why do you think? Because I remember your voice, dumbass. We spoke. Uh, <laughs> how do you how do you even do this? Years of training. Okay. Epic. C31. It's him. He is. It is him. But there's no way. Do you buy accounts? 
Oh no. How the fuck do you get that many accounts then? Ah, oh, that's not that, that much. Brother, your shit is cutting out. Collected. You just collected them? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like, dude. Dude, like, dude, there's no way. How the fuck do you get 40 accounts into one lobby? You have 200 accounts in queue? Yeah. How do you, how do you, how do you make him know that it's me? Uh, I just told him like, oh, this guy. You tell them, uh, you talk to the boss, dude? Yeah, yeah, like, like smart toilet, you. Mama's talking to the bots dude. Damn. So are you gonna be doing this all day? Uh, no, 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 I, no. I'm trying to hit Pred, dude. Come on, help a brother out. Then uh. <laughs> <laughs> is many guys cheating? I'm not doing anything. I'm just playing my video game. That's just crazy. Dude, his cheats are crazy. <laughs> Dude, your shit is crazy. Bro, what the fuck was that, man? <laughs> it's insane. So as your rank, I'm down. Sykes, come on, we can play. Sykes, come on, get on, we can play a little bit. It's not that bad. Right? He did, William. It is him. He said he had 200 accounts that run at the same time. Like 200 accounts that queue up. Yo, destroyer, can I ask you a favor? Oh yeah. It, it's just because I'm I'm gonna play with one of my friends and uh, we kind of want to just like play the game normally, if that makes sense. Oh yeah. yeah. Would, would, would it be fine if you do, uh, just didn't like stream snipe and stuff for a little bit? Yeah, no problem. Okay, thank you, man. Dude, you're the one that gave me 4,000 packs, right? Oh, yeah, that happened. <laughs> Dude, he... I didn't open them. Yeah, I know. Right? Yeah, what, are you mad I didn't open them or what? Oh, uh, yeah, kinda. Yeah, unlucky, man. Minus 4k. I mean, I opened like 500 on your account, but I left uh, with him else for you. Uh, what you? What did you say? Room. You opened 500 on my account? Oh uh, yeah. What are you saying? You haven't That's opened shit for me, dude. I'm. I haven't gotten the heirloom or nothing. You're lying. Uh, yeah, yeah. You don't have a heirloom. I uh, got heirloom. Though. How? How do you know yeah, I don't have an heirloom? Uh, I mean, well, because I was opening them. Then. Okay, it wasn't sure. like 500, it was like 400 or something. Now, unlike Tufi, it does seem that Destroyer2009 is actually the developer of the cheats in question and is the person that is actively committing the offenses that have been seen over the last few months. However, there is something to be noted that it's most likely somebody that's also making money off of selling these hacks and this advertisement kind of motive is definitely a course to say that maybe that's not even the real hacker and just somebody that's actually making cheats and using it to their advantage so there's a lot to be discussed in the future regarding this but unlike Tufi, this person seems to have a lot more knowledge and is rather than just interfering with people's matches also actively developing the cheats that are being used so it's a very different scenario in that regard however it definitely calls into question the security of apex legends as at the current point we do know directly from easy anti-cheat that they currently have found no known rce exploit that can be used for something of this level and they're confident in their stance which at least is them coming out and saying something whereas we've heard absolutely nothing from respawn except the actual apex legends esports twitter letting us know that they would be delaying the na regional finals 
and that's really not telling as to what is happening in the background and when we can expect not only some form of solutions but some form of information upon what is actually the problem and how at risk the random user actually is now currently speaking it is unknown whether or not this is a widespread exploit that a lot of developers know about or if it's something that only destroyer 2009 and his partner in crime random currently know now the problem with that being is if they're actually able to install stuff remotely onto your pc like we saw apparently with the jen burton stream then it's very likely that they could do a lot more and it means that things like putting in your credit card information on pc to unlock apex coins is probably not the safest idea so tread very carefully especially when respawn is going to be releasing gimmick sale after gimmick sale so hopefully we're actually going to be seeing them at least with some decency postpone or delay or even just give some of the stuff that's being supposedly sold away for free which we know is not going to happen they're just going to push it out there and risk it for the biscuit so keep that in mind that right now the game is compromised if you have the game installed on your pc i don't think you're going to be hacked just by having it installed however if you're getting random friend requests messages and so on there is an exploit we don't know how it's actually being used at this current time but we do know that the exploit is affecting pc players and will likely not be a problem for people on the xbox and playstation platforms as well as nintendo switch as it's just not using a standard operating system that the hackers would be able to just you know implement their cheats that they've been developing for windows on so you may be a little bit safer i don't think you're going to see your playstation or xbox get uh aimbot or wall hacks added to it however there could be some reasons not to play with your pc friends that are still logging in so take everything a little bit more carefully than usual in this regard if you're a pc player and logging into apex legends i want you to be safer rather than sorry but of course i need to know what you guys have to say about this one a very interesting situation leave a comment down below are you concerned about the apex legends hacks and this not only being the second or third time that something like this has happened but an even increasingly or exponentially worse situation than what we saw previously so let me know in the comment section down below how you feel about that one and of course guys if you want to continue this conversation or you just want to know about the next giveaway that i'm launching and i highly suggest that you take the time right now check out the social media links i'll put them up on the screen as well as in the description down below give them a like a favor to follow whatever you haven't done already it all helps the channel out absolutely massively but that about wraps it up for this one guys there's not too much more to talk about stay safe while you're in game but thanks for watching thanks for liking thanks for subscribing and don't forget you won't be able to enjoy any of the upcoming good content if you don't stay safe stay healthy and as always have a good one